from uh, Park Avenue North to Beamers Road, that section of Park Street is under the DOT uh, responsibility. Um, and myself, and I, I know Councilman Payton, um, as well as uh, Commissioner Marcus, have been working to try to uh, get that done. From Park Avenue North is the city's uh, responsibility, and we're responsible from uh, Park North on Fire Street. And we have also been working uh, to try to get that done. And as a uh, retired soldier, also, I tell you, don't give up. You know, it's never too early to stop fighting, keep fighting for it, keep working for it. We'll see how it turns out. The trail. Uh, the commission was right. That is a result of a Save Rock the School grant that myself and a group of kids got by getting out and starting a, um, a community trail in that area. And as a result of it, a grant was received. So the city picked it up and kind of put in some money to help finish it. But that was not splashed or told the city money. It was a grant received from the federal government, Save Rock the School, uh, to put that sidewalk in. But I agree with you, we do need sidewalks on Forest, and it does need to be wide. But I just want to get some clarification. I'm from Forest North, from Park Avenue North, that is the DOT. So we all need to look and work with the DOT to try to uh, press that issue and see what we get done in Forest. And I'm pretty sure the council will pay themselves keep working with the city to see what we get done. Appreciate you clarifying that, Councilman Wright. Yeah. And, and the mayor, 